Welcome back to another episode of Released Rangers, the Football Manager 2017 series that we're doing here. This is the fourth episode, I believe. Uh, let's try and play a couple of matches in this episode and uh, let's get right into it. So let's have a quick little recap here. Uh, in the last episode, we played Swindon in the EFL First Round Cup and got through on penalties. And then we played our first home league game of the season against Millwall and won 1-0 in that game as well. So hopefully in this episode we will get through home to Bradford City and away to Rochdale. Uh, let's just have a check on the league. We're in fifth place there. Two wins from two games, two goals and six points. Managed to get Remy Street in the team of the week, centre half. Remember, we're not signing or selling anybody. Okay. Here we go. Bradford City at home in the league. It's quite a few weeks since I recorded the previous two episodes, but Jermaine Pennant did particularly well when he came on. And Mark McNulty has two assists. Let's throw him in from the start. We're going to play attacking with a flexible system. Okay, let's get into the game. Prediction is a 1 0 win to us. They're playing a 4 4 1 1 formation. So we expect a win, nothing but a win. Just going to change the um, change the highlights. So we can actually read what's going on. Yellow card for Tunnicliffe in the seventeenth minute. And we've conceded a penalty. Saved. Well done from the keeper. I was hoping that we could slow down the goals replays when they come in. Hopefully we've done that. Looks like Bradford are clearly on top of this game and might be only a matter of time before we concede. But we've won a free kick. Nothing obviously came of that. Bit of a fussy referee by the looks of it. Having a lot of offsides here. Osborne looks like he's doing well in midfield, although his rating doesn't seem to reflect that. Oh, Pennant's having a good game. I think that was a good decision to put him in from the start. You see from the action areas, we seem to be dominating most players, places of the game. One minute till half time. Not a good chance. Uh, so, reasonable performance. Good save, obviously, from Martin, giving him a 7.3 at half time. Um, what should we tell them? that we still can win this game. Let's get into the second half. Another free kick given away. And a yellow card for Osborne. Well 
Charts for Watkins. Can't put it away. 55 minutes. Let's give it another five and we'll make a substitution. See if we can get something going. Midfield, let's bring Darren Potter on. That's Pennant looking nervous. Bradford making subs as well. Shot from Pennant or by the corner. And Pennant take the corner and then get offside. McNulty again. Let's um, let's put Lafty on up front. Watkins definitely seems to be having most of our chances. We've conceded 74th minute. Let's see. Wyke in from the. Oh, looks like Street Mr. Tattle in at the near post. Good save from Martin and then Cullen at the back post. Probably not much Martin could do about that. Molly Watkins looks like he's having most of the chances, but. We're going to substitute him. We're going to go overloaded because we really want to at least get a point out of this game. Lafferty? No. Osborne? Free kick. Six minutes to go. Can we get anything out of this game? We're going to suffer first defeat of the season. Yellow card for Michael Smith. Two minutes. Three minutes added. Doesn't look like we're going to do it. Well, that was disappointing. Let's uh, tell them so. We should have won that match. It's going to hurt us in the league down to ninth place. Three bookings as well. So, next match is in three days away from home. Let's set the tactics up ready. We're going to go for a standard system. Standard phase of playing, and we're going to keep the same system. We may change the squad a bit close to the time. Kiko has passed a fitness test and is recommended 45 minutes maximum. Let's just have a look. Okay, we've got a fairly fully fit to squad to choose from. Osborne's at 90%, but That should be okay. Have we played five games yet? One, two, three, four. Okay, so we'll give this team one more chance, I think. Let's get Kiko on the bench. I might bring him on in the second half. Um, Pennant did well. Let's go with it. Okay. What we'll start are playing a four one two three matching us up there, so this should be quite a good contest. Let's uh Show me what you can do. Okay, off we go. See how we get on in this match. 
early corner. Nothing comes of it. Oh dear, we've conceded again. 17th minute. Let's see. From the free kick. He just ran across the middle. Clearly nobody wanted to defend that. That's pretty disappointing. Dan Jones, penance injured, gashed head. Let's um, throw him off for Thomas. Let's try not to make it any worse. Watkins goes through with one a free kick. Time to make the substitution. Close from McNulty from the free kick. I think we might start the second half with a bit more of a counter-attacking team. Corner to Rochdale. Watkins, oh, two minutes left. Hmm, okay, let's go to a counter attacking. Let's be a bit more structured in our play and then let's tell them we can still win the match. Well, let's. Seems we've got Kiko on the bench. And he's allowed 45 minutes. Let's put him on. See what we can do. Can see the foul early on. Excellent start. Osborne tripping as well. Martin seems to be doing well in goal, although his rating doesn't. Reflect that. From the corner. Watkins. We've scored a goal. That might be an own goal there. Watkins has finished it. Corner by Smith from the right. Plays it into the back post. And Watkins finishes it. Let's see if we can uh, press on and get a winner now. McNulty seems to have been playing well. And he's put it in. Clearly the move to counter-attack has worked. Tunnicliffe out to Smith. Lovely cross from Smith and McNulty at the near post. Smith's having a great game. 8.7 on the ratings. Henderson for Rochdale. Shoots. Martin could save from Martin. 30 minutes to go. We've only got one sub left. I think we might leave that till a bit later. Performance level seems to have gone up. But Martin's at 6.3. I'm not going to change the goalkeeper. Mid-game. Osborne with another foul. I think we're going to substitute him off. 15 minutes to go. Let's, let's take him off. Potter. Here he comes. Rochdale putting the pressure on. Nine minutes to go. Under the cosh a little bit here. Let's go a bit more of a structured formation. 
and let's go defensive for the last five minutes. McNulty wins a corner. Two added minutes. See if we can hang on it. Ton of cliff, full time. Well, after a very shaky first half, we got ourselves back into it. Let's tell them how pleased we are. And up into sixth place. Man of the match was clearly Smith. Two assists, I believe. Pennant is injured. He's got a gashed head. Let's, uh, let's leave him to the physio. Well, that match report says we were in complete control, but I'm not convinced we were. Kiko came on and did well. So let's set up for the Watford game. We're away from home. <coughs> She's the same tactics we used at the end of the last game. We'll sort the substitutions out and things <coughs> as we get closer. So we'll end that episode there. Uh, two games, a loss, first loss of the season. And f follow that up with a win, which was good. Good comeback, having been 1-0 down in the game. Um, so in the next match, let's just see who we've got. Watford in the EFL Cup and Peterborough at home in the league. So we'll see you next week, Sunday at 7pm. Uh, subscribe to the channel if you're not already. And if you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up. And I'll catch you next time.